Hello everybody and I hope you're having a nice Christmas um, and as you can see here and you probably read the title this is finally number block number 100 in Minecraft and uh, as you probably noticed we're kind of part way through it I had started filming this about about one year ago and um, I don't know what I did with the footage it went missing so we have it, as you can see, and you've seen this before, you, you kind of can figure out how we started. We build the framework, and then we just fill in every little square with um, one color red and a, lightly cut light, and a slightly lighter shade of red. Um, I'm just trying to find it here. I've probably got a color missing. That's right, I'm looking for the red concrete to fill in a few of the bits that I'm missing. So, like I said, I've got a, a, the reddest of red you can get, concrete. Then I'm using, I think, a terracotta red, which is this one. It's slightly got a texture on it. And then maybe pink? I can't remember. It will say at the bottom, but I, I really can't remember. So, I mean, it did take a year to make, but added together it took maybe about 10 hours <laughs> I don't know the footage when I put it all in uh, to edit here came to about five five six maybe seven hours but then that was quite a few hours of me falling asleep uh, I had to delete because it, it's a really it's I'm not gonna lie it's quite boring just doing this back and forth for the size of this one and I've had messages from quite a few of you guys who've also had a go at doing their own number block 100. So you've probably seen this before. Um, done in Minecraft. I'm not sure as big as this though. Um, and I guess this one does complete the set. Uh, and the last video I did, quick, I was a quick one of this, shows um, this whole number block Minecraft thing in VR, which is pretty cool. And you can really get uh, a sense of how bigger they actually are when you stand next to them but uh, it's really hard to do actually in VR it just gets motion sick it's the worst although I guess you guys are the younger younger kids well, it's true younger kids they don't seem to get motion sickness uh, they can read in cars but once you get to a certain age you cannot do that anymore right so uh, and I'm speeding it up now because it's just way way too long so this is like fast fast because it took forever So there's different ways to do this. I found with some of them that are the same colour, it's easier to do it in strips from bottom to top because you just press the place block thing and then hold fly and you just do a whole strip of them. But with this one, because I have to keep stopping and changing colour between um, each square, it makes it a bit slower. So left to right for me did work. And you can get into a bit of a system where you can press and change the colours and get like a, a kind of a, a bit of a groove going. But it's pretty tricky. I noticed, I think I mentioned before, because it used to be their own version, the PS4 version of Minecraft. And then they brought it in line with the rest and they made it, um, I, can't, I can't remember, Java version. And it was the same now, so you can play it across platform. But what I did notice, though, is the controls, they changed. They went from being quite solid and they were, they were, they were what we were used to on, on PlayStation to being really kind of more loose so I found it harder just to stay in a straight kind of like horizontal line we're going side to side anyway I've got used to it now and it you know it wasn't too bad but it does every now and again got to keep stopping no, uh, knocking blocks away that kind of thing so
Now, after finally finishing one side, we're on to well, one, well the front part of it, we're on to the side, one of the edges now. Uh, these don't take long at all because there's only one block up, one block of one, if you know what I mean. There we go, it's starting to take shape now, but we've still got the entire back of it to do and the other side. I think I did the top already, and I've also not finished making the framework on the other side too, so I've got to get that red concrete back out again and finish making the squares. Nearly at the top. There we go, that's what kind of one front side and one edge done. Now, here, I was thinking of going up and adding the the actual frame of the cubes in as I go but when you daydream and start to do this it's easy to miss and keep on going up so I thought I'd better put in the structure too so I think in a minute I will go through and put in all the the dividing lines
Right, and we've nearly finished this side now. We've only got a few more blocks to do. And it's such a great feeling when you get to the top and you know that's the last brick. Now with the back finished, I'm going to head to the side. And like I did on the other side, just fill this one in quite quickly. Now when this is finished, we can finally work our way around to the front and make the face. So there's quite a lot of options I was looking at when it comes to faces, there's quite a few expressions, as they all have. But um, I was working off pictures, so I decided to go for one with an open mouth and with his eye looking up, as you will see. And there we go, some up and down there, great. Now, now I keep floating back and flying back just to check, because it's kind of, kind of got a grid thing on it with this one. You can easily see when you look at the pictures where to put them, you know, it's like two blocks down, three across. So you can get the eye in exactly the right position. And the same for the mouth too, because you can use the squares as kind of coordinates. So I found that quite easy. It's just trying to get the thickness and trying to make the eye look right. And it's, you probably noticed with the number block, with, with, I'm with number one, two, I'm 100. The eye is not quite square, it's kind of rounded. So, but mine mostly does look square though, so. But, um, yeah. So using, um, I think it's block of quartz, because block of quartz is ever so slightly brighter than white concrete I've found. There's probably something brighter like snow maybe uh, for a white, but I've always used block of quartz for mine. So um, I'm filling in the white of the eye now. And this, is only gonna go, this is only going to go part way down. Then I'm going to switch back to the red for the lower eyelid. There we are. Because he's, uh, he's kind of looking up, so that will make it, give it that effect. This is much easier now, much much quicker than, there we go. Um, I did black for the eye, and trying to get this shape was a bit tricky. On the picture I'm working off, I'll maybe put it on the screen and show you. Uh, it's kind of a weird eye shape, kind of wide at the top and narrow at the bottom nearly there. So once I've got the outline, I'll then break away all the blocks in the middle and fill it in with black. So as you can see there, I keep getting the lost controller. So I wasn't actually, because it gets quite boring uh, to make, I uh, actually do this connecting remotely to my um, PlayStation from my computer while also so then watching a film on TV, otherwise it gets a bit much just staring at this. So, um, and, but the network for some reason kept dropping my connection, so that's why you keep seeing that. Now onto the mouth, which is an open smiley mouth with some teeth. So it's always a bit tricky because you're working on this scale to try and get that shape. I thought this time round I didn't do too bad, so a few adjustments that'll do, and then I need to make his lips thicker. Going back to check that. Quite hard to see sometimes because you're so close up. There we are. Once I'm happy with that, I'll add the teeth and then just fill in the black of the mouth afterwards. Adding some and knocking some away to try and get roughly the right picture. Let's put the black in. And then, once we've done this, there's only uh, the numbering to do. There we go. And this doesn't take long, just a one, zero, and a zero. Now, these numberings, number, numberings are bigger, because number block 100 is much, much bigger. They're actually not the usual number of blocks I use. I've made them bigger, so it kind of fits more. Otherwise, it looks so tiny, a tiny, tiny number on a thingy on the top. So there we go, that last thing I did there, knock away the guide blocks I hit at the bottom, and that's it. It's only taken a year, um, but we finally finished number block 100. So yeah, I hope you enjoyed that. Um, let us know in the comments what else you want us to make. Um, anything before the end of the year, 
Where have I gone? There we go. I don't know where I was going then. There we go. So yeah, have a go yourself. Send us a link if you've made number block 100 already. But that's... Is that the complete set made in Minecraft? I think it might be. Um, I know you guys, when we did the form one, say there's some missing there. I can't think what they are. Let us know in the comments. Um, uh, thank you for watching and subscribing if you are subscribed. And we'll see you next time. Bye.